guys i'm back with another vlog and today i'm gonna be doing the my first time tag challenge so ang ginawa ko is nagsulit ako ng 25 questions no so ang ginawa ko is gumawa ko ng 25 lists of my first times and some are interesting and some are you know just to let you guys know me better and gusto ko tong gantong klase ng mga videos kasi uh, gusto ko na mak mas makilala nyo pa ako so uh, make sure na comment down below if you guys are interested na gumawa pa ng mga gantong klase ng videos and let me know so please comment down below so dapat ang gagawin ko sana dito is 50 50 list pero sabi ko that's too long it's gonna be boring, so I narrowed it down to half of it. So we need to find another shot. All right. So without further ado, let's get on with the video. Let's go. Okay. So si simulan mo na natin siya sa basics. Si simplehan mo na natin siya and then ah uh, natin siya interesting. Your first foreign country you've ever visited or pagbakasyonan. So yung first uh, foreign country ko na napagbakasyon na namin ng family ko is nung grade 4 ako, I was 10 years old so it was my sister's birthday so pumunta kami sa Hong Kong so wala namin kami nagawa doon pumunta kami Ocean Park pumunta kami Hong Kong Disneyland yung uh, wax museum doon sa Hong Kong and yung mga uh, parang rides nila, parang uh, traps nila, parang gan mga trains. So, yun yung first foreign country na visit ko when I was 10 years old. Next is, tell me about your first makeup item. So, yung first makeup item ko is, kasama ko yung sister ko. Bumunta kami sa mall. So, bumili kami ng lipstick. So, yun yung first uh, makeup item ko. It's a lipstick from Everbule na yata. I don't know. I forgot. So, yun yung first makeup item ko. Your first car lesson or your driving lesson. So, yung first driving lesson ko was uh, three years ago. Ang nagturo ko sa akin is yung uncle ko. Uh, yun yung first time ko na mag... Ay, hindi. Ang, ang nagturo sa akin is yung lolo ko. Yun yung first session ko. It was frustrating. It was hard. Kasi manual yun. So, yun. Naalala ko yun noong... Naalala ko kasi may part dun sa subdivision na nam, namin na kailangan mong pagkaikot mo, iikot ka ulit. So, buti na lang walang kanal dun, walang poste, walang puno. So, nag-dive yung kotse dun sa parang gilid. So, pagkaikot namin, umano yung kotse. Nag-dive yung kotse dun. So, yung second time na driving ko is with my uncle naman. So, okay lang. Wala naman masyado nangyari doon. Yung third time is yung kasama ko si Mami. So, yun din sa same spot na yun, kung saan lumiko kami ng lolo ko, nag-dive ulit yung kotse doon. So, the next day na ulit nakuha yung kotse. So, yun. Pero buti na lang, walang damage yung kotse. So, that's, that's good. Next is, tell me about your first celebrity crush. So, yung first celebrity crush ko is when I was in grade 4. Yung Jonas Brothers. Puso na, puso na lang yung Jonas Brothers kasi may talaga ako manood ng Disney Channel. So, I was really obsessed with them. Every video nila sa YouTube pinapanood ko. Every video sa YouTube nila pinapanood ko. So, yun ang, yun ang first celebrity crush ko. And naalala ko, nung pag first day of school, bago magpasokan, gumagawa kami ng daddy ko tsaka ng sister ko nung parang name tag or sa notebooks namin. So, may picture dun sa gilid. Sa imbes na picture ko dapat yung nakalagay, ang nilagay ko dun is yung silang tatlo, yung Jonas Brothers kasi ganun ako ka-obsessed. But I think, I think it was cute na maliit ako. So, yun ang first celebrity crush ko when I was little. First concert that I've been to. So, yung first concert that I've been to was a Lady Gaga concert. It was high school ako nun eh. Parang 
between grade 6 and high school. So, mga ganun. High school, high school times. So, yun yung first uh, concert that I've been to. Ano yun? I think it was free. Uh, yung galing yung in tickets na yun, galing siya sa friend ng mom ko kasi yung husband niya nag-work uh, sa I don't know, solar entertainment yata. And then we got free tickets. We were very excited. Uh, may pictures non, but um, sa Facebook ko yung pictures non if you want to check it out. Sa mga Facebook friends ko dyan. <laughs> yung gusto yung tingnan. Uh, that was five years ago, six years ago, I think. So, medyo mukhang, eh, I look like trash. So, yeah, it was a Lady Gaga concert. It was fun, very exciting. Yung mga videos, my pictures. So, yeah. My first piercing, and when did I get it? So, yung first piercing ko is, I was a baby. Literally a baby. I was months old. Hindi ko alam kung ilang months. Pero, I was months old. And, yun. So, I didn't remember much about it. Pero, I got my second piercing. It's here. I got it nung January. Kasama ko yung best friend ko, no? Nagpa-pierce kami. Hindi ko sinabi sa mommy ko yun na may second piercing ako. Pero, lagi ko nang sinasabi sa kanina na magpapa-pierce ako. Pero, that day, nang nagpa-pierce ako ng second piercing ko, hindi ko sinabi sa mommy ko. And pag-uwi niya, wala naman siya sinabi about it. So, that was great. <laughs> it was cool. She was cool about it. Your first time on a plane. So, yung first time ko sumakay sa airplane was, yun nga, nung pumunta kami ng Hong Kong, nagbakasyon kami sa Hong Kong. Yung first time ko. And I was very, I was very, very excited. And somehow scared kasi <laughs> Mas dami akong napanood ng mga horror movies about a plane crash and all that. Pero eventually nasanay na din ako. It's my fifth time riding an airplane this year. So, yun, nasanay na lang ako. And, yun. Next is my first YouTube video. So, your first YouTube video ko was 8 months ago. It started I started posting in uh, December, so it was around a few weeks before Christmas time. So, the first YouTube video ko was me playing the piano and singing to Justin Bieber's Cold Water. So, the story nun is, hindi ko talaga sinasadyang i-post yun sa YouTube. So, I was bored sa bahay. So I started to, you know, why not practice the piano, uh, try to do a cover. So I a few days later, uh, I practiced ko na siya. I got the chords right, I got the lyrics right. So I said, why not ano, record it? Para lang malaman ko kung okay siya. I mean, kung tama siya sa tono, ganyan. And so yun, it took a lot of takes. Actually, it took like 10, 5 to 10 takes. So, ayun, sabi ko, ay, ito, okay na to, pwede na to, pwede. Tapos, a few, a few weeks later, siguro it took like a month. Sabi ko, gusto ko yung mag, ano, mag-start ng YouTube channel. May YouTube account ako noon pa, pero para lang muna doon YouTube video, makapag-subscribe ako sa kanila, ganyan. So, I started posting that video, yung Justin Bieber's Cold Water. And, hindi ko siya shinare. <laughs> hindi ko pa siya shinare na parang it's just out there, man. It's just for fun, you know. So, ano, I was bored then, so why not, you know, post it, yung video na yun. So, eventually, the next day, it got 50 views. So, eventually, you know, I started posting covers, and then I started posting vlogs, started posting challenges. So it's just it just kept going and going, and going. Because I realized ko na it's fun. It's actually fun. It's fun to edit. It's fun to post. Being creative. Sa mga videos mo ganyan. So yun. Yun yung 
first YouTube video ko. Maybe the link will be down below. I don't know. But yeah. My first cooking experience. So yung first cooking experience ko was na maliit pa ako. Nasa bahay kami ng lola ko. And yung lola ko kasi mahilig siya mag-bake. Mahilig siya mag-bake ng iba't ibang klase. Mahilig siya mag-bake ng cookies, uh, cakes, bread, ganyan. So, yung first time ko was is kasama ko yung lola ko. So, syempre mga apo niya bilang maliliit, ganyan. Kailangan ng mga activities. Ganyan. Pag nandun kami pala, Yes, lagi siyang nagbe-bake ng cookies, chocolate chip cookies. So, nandun kami ng sister ko, mga pinsan ko. Nandun kami, tinutunan naman namin siyang mag-bake. So, it was fun. So, yun yung first time experience ko na magluto. Yeah. My first ever mobile phone. So, I was in grade 4 ulit. Ang daming naganap sa akin ng grade 4 ako. <laughs> so, yung first phone ko was yung Nokia na black and white pa eh. Tapos, ang um, pwede lang dun is call and text. Tapos, ang laro lang na nandun is yung snake. Tsaka yung space... space something. So, yun lang yung ginagawa ko. Puro games lang dun. And hanggang ngayon, puro games lang din naman ako. So, yun yung first phone ko. Actually, sa klase namin, yung grade 4 ako, sa klase namin, ako lang yung may phone na ganun. So, lahat sila yung may colored na yung may flip na na phone, yung Motorola, yun yung dating iPhone. So, pag meron ka nun, ikat ka, mayaman ka. So, ako lang yung may ganun, yung maliit lang na Nokia, na black and white. So, yun yung first uh, mobile phone ko. Okay. Next is, your first musical instrument. So, my first musical instrument was when I was 10 years old. Third part ulit ako. So, may music class kami. Naalala ko, kailangan namin bumili. Magdala ng flute dun sa class namin kasi kailangan na. So, para sa music class ko. So, yun. Yun yung first music instrument ko. And it's hard. Mahirap siya. Mahirap siyang aralin. Imagine mo, 10 years old. Nag-aano ng flute. Nagbubasa ng notes ng flute. Mahirap siya. It's really hard. And then... After noon, a few years later, uh, pinasok kami ng daddy ko, ng sister ko, sa piano class. And I think one session lang yata yung, yung natapos namin. Tapos after that, wala na. And then, eventually, pumasok ako sa guitar. Um, ano lang yan, self-studied lang. Then, bumalik ulit ako sa piano, pero yung basic uh, chords lang. And then, ukulele. So, yun. Um, I really love music kasi who doesn't, diba? So, yeah, My first instrument, musical instrument was, and was a flute. Next. What was your first video game and gaming console? So, my first uh, video game, game console was, my first gaming console ko is a PlayStation 1. So, naalala ko yung daddy ko, meron siya lang sa office. So, pag nag-revisit kami doon, pagdating namin doon, meron siyang surprise daw. So, I was like, very excited. Siyempre, maliit ako noon. Tapos, yun, nakita ko may PlayStation 1. And then, yung first gaming console ko, yung first game na nalaro ko doon sa uh, PlayStation 1 ko was yung it's this racing game called GTR Gran Turismo something parang ganon so and then yun yun yung dun ako na in love sa mga video games so until now mahilig ko din ako dun next is your first broken bow so I'm really really thankful sa buong 21 years ko I haven't broken a bow yet. Pero, papasalamat ako sa Diyos na hindi pa ako na, na sisiraan ng buto. Kung mangyari man yun, it will be a terrible experience, but I hope not. My first tattoo. So, wala pa akong tattoo, but since I'm 21, I hope I'll get one. Um, it's gonna be like a... So, matching kami ng sister ko. And, hopefully one day, we'll get a tattoo when we see each other again. 
Okay, so next is my first time riding a bike. So, it was my birthday. And yung daddy ko, dinala niya ako sa mall. Pumunta kami sa biking shop. And pinapili niya ako kung anong klaseng bike yung gusto ko. So, nung unang gusto yung pakuha niya sa akin, it's a mountain bike. Pero since malit ako, it's too big for me. So, ang pinili ko is yung BMX bike. And hindi ako marunong mag-bike nun. So, so, nung tinest ko yung bike, the, the guy had to put training wheels. So, I was riding around the mall to test it with my training wheels. And then, pag uwi namin, syempre nag-bike ako, ganyan. I was so happy nung may regalo akong bike kasi matagal ko nang gusto magkaroon ng bike. So, few weeks later, yung training wheels niya, tabi ni na siya. So, pag nagbabike ako, hindi na siya balanced. So, sabi ng daddy ko, ano, tanggalin na natin yung training wheels. Noong una, ayaw ko pa. Pero eventually, I gave in. Kasi nga, kailangan ko na rin matutun mag-bike noon. I was 10 years old. Tinanggal niya. And then, tinaguan niya ako mag-bike, mag-balance. And, nahulog ako many times. So, mga scratches ako. Ito, may scar pa ako dito. Sa tuhod, dito, tsaka dito. May scar ako noon. So, yung friend ng daddy ko, may anak siya na maliit. So, I think he was, tawag ko kung ilang taon siya, basta maliit siya. So, may bike siya. Tapos, nauna pa siyang matutong mag-bike isa sa akin. So, nung nandun kami sa bahay nila, may bike siya. So, naglalaro lang kami sa labas, ganyan. So, nung tines ko yung bike niya, ano, nakapag-balance na ako agad ng mabuti. Ang maliit, maliit talaga yung bike niya. So, nung, yun nga, natu doon ako natuto yung first, ano ko, mag-bike. Doon ako natuto mag-balance, doon sa maliit ng bike. And then, pag-uwi namin, the next day, eh, sumakay ako doon sa BMX bike ko. And then, yun, natuto na ako, doon ako natuto mag-bike, mag-balance. So, ayun, I'm very proud na marunong ako mag-bike. Tsaka yung sister ko, marunong din siya mag-bike. So, what? First alcoholic drink. So, my first alcoholic drink is... It was an accident. So, nung una, akala ko water siya. Nakalagay siya sa glass. Tapos, pag inom ko, it was gin yata or vodka. I don't know, I forgot. But, yun, nakala ko water siya. So, I took a big gulp and it was disgusting. So, since then, Di, di ako uminom ng alcohol, alcoholic drinks. Kasi it was traumatizing. Pero, yun, kahit naman hindi naging traumatizing siya para sa akin, um, I still won't drink. It's, it's bad for your health. So, I'm a good girl. Yeah. And, yun, yun yung first alcoholic drink na natikman ko. It's disgusting. It's weird. So, yeah. What was your first date experience? So, wala pa akong first date experience. Yes. Um, <laughs> pero kung bibigyan man ako ng chance na magkaroon ng first date, gusto ko is yung mga extreme dates. Yung mga extreme dates talaga kasi feeling ko yung mga movie dates, dinner dates yung mga ganun. Or hindi siya para sa akin. I don't know. Hindi ko lang kung masaya yun para sa iba. Sa kanil na yun, I respect that. And ang gusto ko lang talaga is yung extreme dates. Ganun. Kasi um, dun ko makikita kung may uh, we have something in common. Ganyan. If he likes to kung, um, I mean, kung mahilig din siya sa mga challenges. Ganyan. Mga extreme stuff na I don't know. Basta ganun. Yan, yun yung first um, ideal date ko, kung mangyayari man yun. Pero, ang pinaka-first uh, gusto kong ma-experience na date is manood ng basketball, front row, front row seats, basketball. Kung PBA man yan, it's okay, NBA, it's okay. Basta yun, yun yung first uh, date experience na gusto ko. And last but not the least, is my first time going to a fair. My first time going to a fair was a few months ago. 
with my best friend. Uh, shout out ulit sa'yo, lovely. <laughs> um, so, yung first time ko is dun sa lugar namin, sa Tanza. May fiesta kasi dun every year. So, pag may fiesta, may mga bands, may mga, may mga stores na bukas. Tapos, may mga food stands doon, ganyan. And may fair. So, dun sa fair na yun, yung best friend ko, niyaya niya akong sumakay dun sa fair. So, wala na, napakabilis umikot. So, it was scary. Sigaw kami ng sigaw. Yung mga videos niya sa Facebook ko ulit. Kasi, hindi ko alam kung ilalagay ko siya. It's gonna be hard for me to edit. Pero yun, Sigaw kami nung sigaw. It's very fun. It was very funny. So, okay na rin yun. Na na-experience ko magpumunta sa fair. Matagal ko na rin gustong pumunta sa fair. So, it was a fun experience. Pagbaba namin, nanginginig ako. Hindi ko maintindihan sa pagkama ko. Pero, yun. Yung first time ko pumunta sa fair. It was a great experience. So that was today's video. I hope you guys liked it. Make sure to leave a like, comment, and subscribe to my channel if you haven't. And if you're new, make sure to do that. So please guys, comment down below as I have said in the intro earlier. Comment down below if you guys want to see these kinds of videos, mga Q&As, or something that you guys want to know more about me. Kasi ako nag-enjoy din mismo. So make sure to click here if you want to subscribe and click here and here if you want to watch my previous videos so yeah that's pretty much it and i'll see you guys next time peace